my name is Harvey Lacey, and we are all excited about Ubuntu Blocks 6.935, whatever. It's the latest development that we've had. One of the issues that we had when we came to Haiti here in, in November was uh, we were trying to do an evaluation to do a project out in um, the rural area outside of Cavillon. When I got there, what I realized was there was just enough styrofoam and trash to be ugly, but not enough to use to build houses. One of my minders or escorts suggested this wonderful product called Vitiver. They uh, produce this in fields and they boil it down and extract all of the oil. And they're left with this stuff and it's a problem because they have to burn it. Well, when he showed me a sample of it, I like went crazy because this stuff is just so perfect for a building block structurally. It compresses down and it just ties itself together and it just is absolutely wonderful. This material, another benefit of it, is they are using it in Thailand in earth blocks, these roots to uh, deter the termites. It burns very slowly and since it's this texture, we do not need to use chicken wire to make the plaster. So now we have a product that we can use the Ubuntu Blocks technology, which is we tie the blocks like this, we run our wire, we tie to the wire, and we bring it up so that it's, the house reacts to an earthquake more like a fence, a, a woven wire fence than a concrete block wall. It also gives us the strength that we get when we do a, hur a hurricane wind force test and we get the structure that is just totally awesome. This here's the block that we made the Ubuntu blocks with, which is really wonderful. The issues with it is it's like 43 to 60 cents just for the rice bag material. We throw the wire on here. The cost of it is in somewhere between 60 and 70 cents per block. When we went to this shear, we went to a polypropylene tube and then we put it in here and now we're using the uh, polypropylene twine. We now have a block that costs approximately 14 and a half cents. This one here, <laughs> using the polypropylene twine, we get a block that costs a fraction of a penny for contents. So uh, this here probably won't be applicable in a, a real urban area, but it will be applicable in a rural area. It's just exciting beyond measure. You know, you, you come here and you find this problem and then this wonderful solution just... We're doing something nobody has ever done before. I am really excited.